Hello dudes and dudettes, smurfs, dogs and cats. This is Zeno and today I bring you a battle against uh, Poor could Scooby, one of my closer friends here on YouTube. And um, yeah, I have a question for you guys. Uh, my sister wants to watch some cartoons and I have like nothing to recommend her. So uh, you guys tell me, because I know cartoons aren't that gory. I know a 12 year old can watch them at any place at any time uh, without no problem. So you guys tell me what was your favorite cartoon? cartoon when you were young and as you have seen the text right there yeah for me it was He-Man and Mighty Max but what was your favorite cartoon please leave a comment below about that and uh, you know so I have some stuff to recommend her plus uh, leave a comment about this question what do you prefer future Pokemon Vive videos having Pokemon music like in this video or do you prefer just a silent mode nothing in the background just me talking you know and uh, I prefer this over that but if you guys prefer that over this, let me know in the comments below. It's all about you guys and it's nothing about me. So, you guys come first. Anyways, he's gonna go for the overheat. And he's gonna do a crap load. He's gonna do a shizzle load. He gets a crit because, you know, Scooby just sends out Scooby. You know, Major Hex is coming, play, playing the big role, you know. So, he's gonna switch out, make a nice play. Maybe thinking the air slash will not kill, but I believe it would have killed even with that uh, sharp uh, lowered special attack. Uh, there may be a chance, you know, he's got life orb. Uh, and I believe he was predicting my switch, so, you know, switch at the same time. But I predict Toxic right here. I'm gonna go to Venom Fang. And um, I'm gonna uh, predict the Charizard switch, uh, uh, switch. I'm gonna Toxic that thing. That was nice. Now the reason I'm saying I predict the, the Charizard switch is because Politoed can use a refresh. So poisoning uh, Politoed is pretty pretty useless if he does have a refresh. But I still don't know. So uh, yeah, uh, we we will see. I'm gonna poison it and right now the Dongasho is doing what he's doing best, uh, you know, toxic stalling. He's gonna make a mighty play, predict my switch uh, and he's gonna hit me with Fox Blast, pretty lucky but not lucky enough and that's not gonna kill me. So Dongastro is just standing here chilling, recurring, you know, all that uh, annoying stuff, you know, that's what Gastro does best. Annoys the hell out of everybody. So he's gonna switch out and he's gonna go to Mr. Grin and every time I read that text right there, Mr. Grin, it reminds me of R Mr. Grinch. Just with like a smile version of Mr. Grinch, I don't know, happy Mr. Grinch, yeah. Yeah, that uh, just disturbing, damn it, that part though, it's just like, wow. Okay, so I'm gonna Earth Power here and uh, what special D lower, I'm thinking you know, it's uh, obviously gonna switch out, right? He's gonna switch out, right? No, he's gonna stay in. I was like, wow. So I surf, uh, knowing that he does have a water absorb. I did not forget about that, but I was really sure he's gonna switch out because Polito uh, doesn't have any recovery moves. So I was thinking he's not gonna stay in. I mean, with special D-Lord, Earth Power is gonna do a lot. And I'm actually a special attacker, all around special attacker. So as you may see, Earth Power does a lot against a special D Polytoad with max HP and max special D of course. This is game. Dude, you know you're just using free Pokemon once, right? Uh, so I'm just staring at that Pokemon right there. What do we say? Those Pokemon right there. Freaking heads and uh, yeah I'm gonna go to Lord Zap because Lord Zap can eat whatever that birdie packs. And um, yeah he does eat uh, that like a man. But Lord Zap is gonna fail in a second as he's gonna switch out to Charizard, have it as a good death far as he's gonna go for the grass. So Lord Zap plus grass equals fail and uh, Charizard fire plus flying equals win. So right there I'm like okay I need to have something as a death far, I'm gonna go to Dawn Gastro, Overheat is uh, coming, Blaze is activated, that's one deadly power. And it's gonna do a lot, and it does like uh, that crit uh, the beginning. So, yeah, Blaze is uh, pretty deadly. But uh, because you know Life Orb and uh, Poison uh, damage, uh, that Charizard is mainly making his own grave. So that's pretty good. Uh, he's gonna go back to his uh, freaking free heads, free Pokemon at once. So I'm like, dude, seriously, stop using free Pokemon. 
it's like lo look at the sprite. I mean, he's using like one head, one head, three heads, one head. It's like one, two, freaking five and six. You're just using six Pokemon right now. So I ice punch like a retard. Uh, being shorted, it's gonna kill. Plus, if he switches out, pretty really obvious uh, close combat. He may have a ghost Pokemon. I don't know. But yeah, they're lack. You know, never use lack ghost, but there's still a chance he can get. He can have a dust clops or something. Still didn't see his lag guys, but that was a big mistake because close combat would have killed. And now I need to go to Ampharos, get some extra damage in, and take it out with a hidden power grass. And I I'm just I don't know what the hell am I doing. Hidden power grass is still predicting a switch and knowing that it will kill. So in the end, it was a safer move, but uh, it shows that I'm predicting a little too much in this game. So um, yeah, uh, Pikachu is gonna come into the game, and don't be fooled. Pikachu may look. Uh, yeah, not powerful enough to take you out, but don't be fooled, this thing is powerful. It has Grass Knot, it has freaking Surf, it has t ball it has... Did it say Grass Knot? Wow, he does have Grass Knot. Weird, but it's true. It actually has Fly, I actually heard that he can fly, I don't know how the hell that's possible. Pikachu, you goddamn cheap bastard, seriously, you need to use your balloons to fly, right? Because seriously, how the hell can you fly? I don't know, maybe that's a lie. I don't really believe it, but I heard there was an event or something, uh, and you can catch a Pikachu that can fly. So, anyways, um, the thing about Pikachu is his light ball that uh, doubles his attack and special attack and makes him very deadly. And he's actually more powerful than his evolved form. And that's something new that cannot really be said about a lot of Pokemon. So, uh, in the end, uh, you can see how much t bolt will do against my Venafang. Yeah, it does near half to me, and I was like, wow, my Venafang is special D, EV train, and this thing is very powerful. Uh, yeah, I'm talking about the Pikachu. Uh, and uh, Bug Buzz, uh, he's gonna go for one more t bolt uh, I'm not gonna lose, there may be a chance he's gonna paralyze me, or, uh, you know, get a crit, I don't wanna risk that, I'm gonna Bug Buzz shoot it away. Not get hit, uh, giving him the time to get another sub up, because that's the thing. Do not let Pikachu get a sub up. Seriously, do not let him get a sub up, and do not switch out when you face a Pikachu. He may, he may nest plot. So uh, seriously, that thing is powerhouse. Bug Buzz didn't kill because you know Dust Ox uh, special attack is pretty much non-existing. And now I'm, go I'm gonna go to Belly Drum. Uh, so far, uh, he's gonna take me down while wow, that did a lot, but didn't get me to the select, which is you know fair in games. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna take him out with the EQ, and that Pikachu did a lot. Really, it takes down the Ampharos, it takes down the freaking Venomoth, but it didn't really matter because I still didn't see his last guy. But little spoilers here, you can just turn uh, down the room if you don't want to hear it. His last guy counters pretty much all the guys that were down right now so uh, yeah it doesn't really matter um, that deadly just let you guys know the last guy is deadly and yeah so I'm gonna go to this go uh, pretty much uh, EQ is the best move I can go with my more heart knowing that uh, I'm physical because I'm barely drummer I need to be physical and uh, yeah, uh, I totally agree with people. As I'm trying to take this thing down, I'm just gonna say something I read in the previous video. I totally agree on somebody posting a comment below why it's more hard to actually never use. Well, it's the same as Espeon. Why the hell is the Espeon never use? I mean, that thing is even more powerful. Psychic like Specs is just ripping apart everything, but you gotta know that uh, it doesn't, it's not based on Wi Fi, it's based on Shoddy. Why is McMortar actually never used? Well, it's based on usage, and I believe in Shoddy, it's not used all that much, so it's based, you know, it was sent into all never use. But, anyways, uh, Toxic Mist at the beginning. When I predict right, uh, I get uh, screwed by the game. Didn't really matter, his last guy is Medichan. In the end, he would have just ju high jump kicked me if I would have been like in higher HP, but I'm not. And Psycho Cut for the kill. So, good game, Scooby. Uh, I have enjoyed. I hope you guys enjoyed as well. And I'll catch you guys next time.